The Cozad Haymakers were in Kearney on Friday night to take on the Kearney Catholic Stars in a District 6 matchup in Class C1. And here in the first quarter, it was Lyndon and Howe, the running back for Kearney Catholic, getting the edge and turning up field for a big 22-yard carry. Howe had over 150 rushing yards on the night for the Kearney Catholic Stars. Now here in the second quarter, Adam Cole finding one of his favorite targets over the middle, Dylan Geyser, for a big completion and a first down. And on the very same drive up next, it would be a handoff to Matthew Schuster, the sophomore, able to get the edge and turn it upfield into the end zone. Great block there from Dylan Geyser as Schuster gets into the end zone for the 17-yard score. Kozat up 7 to nothing at that point. Now here towards the tail end of the first half, Carney Catholic trying to put a drive together, but the fumble by Lyndon Howe on the option pitch. Kozad would recover, and it would be 7 to nothing. Kozad coming into the second half. And here to begin the second half on the opening kickoff, it would be fumbled by the Kozad Haymakers and recovered by Carney Catholic. So that quickly, the Stars would get back on offense, but would have to settle for a 20-yard field goal. 7 to 3, Kozad would lead at that point. And now here as we head into the fourth quarter, still 7-3, Kozab with the lead. Here you see Heinrich Harburg, the quarterback for Carney Catholic, with a swing out pass to Lyndon Howe, who turns it upfield for a huge 42-yard catch and run. And a couple plays later, Harburg again rolling out to his right and finding his receiver downfield. That's Jacob Tucker, 31 yards untouched into the end zone. It would be 9-7, Carney Catholic taking the lead after they missed the extra point. Now still here in the fourth quarter, Adam Cole with a huge 28-yard catch and run to Maddox Meyer on a second and 25 Maddox Meyer, our player of the game for this game-changing play right here. And that would set up a couple of plays later. Adam Gold, the swing out pass to Connor Westcote from 16 yards out, punching it in 15-9. to The Haymakers would take the lead at that point, coming from behind down 9-7. Now on the final drive of the game for Carney Catholic, Harburg would try to roll out to his left. He would fumble the ball, recovered by Nathan Breon there. And the Kozad Haymakers come back on the road to win their fifth game in a row. They are now 5-2 on the season, defeating Carney Catholic 15-9.